a blessed day and welcome this morning we will be meditating on the book of philippians chapter 1 and verse 6 being confident of this that he who began a good work in you will carry it on to completion until the day of christ jesus this morning we are going to learn a very important lesson and that is that we are only managers of god's property not owners and this verse proves it paul combines the past present and future while wonderfully illustrating that god was the one who began the ministry god is the one who is going to continue the work and god is the one who will bring it to completion beloved ones when god has initiated and ordained a thing he is responsible to maintain it have you ever watched a symphony orchestra just before a performance is about to begin the musicians sit and stand about strumming on strings blowing into horns beating on drums there's a lot of noise but no music then the conductor enters he walks to his podium and steps up on it his eyes sweep the scene before him all the musicians and all their instruments he lifts his baton pauses there for a moment and then gives the down beat instantly there is music all instruments blend into one harmonious whole our human spirits are a lot like symphony orchestras within us there may be discordant elements warring fractions that pull this way or that and we are out of focus out of tune we just not together within as an orchestra needs a master control when we turn the whole focus of our attention to our lord and acknowledge that he is in command our lives will give forth harmonious music the greatest issue we face today is that when we become the owners we are required to provide sustain and complete what we initiate this is why many are stressed and worried today because they have positioned themselves in the wrong seat paul was carefree because he understood this principle well from today onwards Let's let God be the owner of our lives, family, children, ministry and future while we manage his resources diligently. Let us pray. Heavenly Father, help me to remember my role and never do things that I'm not called to. In Jesus name I pray. Amen. Shalom Maranatha